So we have this short little equation to solve negative x to the sixth power equals three times x to the fifth power. Both sides are divisible by x, but do not divide by x. What is the worst thing we can do in mathematics? It's division by zero. And if you look at the equation and substitute zero into it, it seems obvious that zero will be a solution. So do not divide by x. But if you feel like dividing by something, that is the same as subtract and factor. Because this equation is of a higher degree than 1, that means we need to wipe out one side to 0, factor the other side, and apply the 0 product rule. In order to avoid a negative leading coefficient, we're going to add x to the 6th power to both sides. The left-hand side becomes 0, and this is x to the 6 plus 3x to the 5. Now we're going to factor the expression on the right-hand side. So that is a quite big GCF, right? Both, both x to the 6 and 3x to the 5 are divisible by, by x to the 5. And x to the 5 times x will give us x to the 6, and x to the 5 times 3 will give us 3x to the 5th power. So now we factored the right-hand side. So visually, it looks like there are two factors, but this is x times x times x. So that is five of them, and this is the sixth one, right? This is a six degree six equation. So when we apply the zero product rule to the six uh, factors, the first five will always say the same thing, x equals to zero, or x plus three equals to zero when x is negative three. So even though this expression is of degree six, we only have two solutions. Uh, it is a fact that uh, an equation cannot have more solutions than its degree, but it can have less, and this is an example for that. Thank you for watching.